Okay, hello everybody, and welcome back to Mass Effect Andromeda, where I forgot to read the, uh, these things. You know what I'm saying? Korra, since your gardening trip to Eos, Korra is much calmer and more optimistic about her future. Even if it doesn't involve being a Pathfinder, she's ready to move forward. You and Korra have the utmost trust and respect for each other and make a strong team. Hehehe, <laughs> Ray is, <laughs> Petra Gill, um, deepening the bond between you, Gill has introduced you to his best friend, Jill. Yeah, that went quick. Uh, okay. This hasn't changed or anything. Um, but um. What? I don't even, like, they, they, these seem so, like, like, you could just put them all under, like, the same thing, almost. My psychological profile hasn't changed. <laughs> Alright, I did decide that we should probably do the dissension in the ranks. We're gonna go investigate the crashed ships on Elodin. And then we will hopefully after that. Uh, is this Elodin? No. Oh, okay, that's what it is. Supplies for Elodin. Okay. System view. I just feel like we need a little more information before we jump on to the Meridian. Like, the kit probably won't be gone after we complete the main mission, even though that would be so convenient. I would love it if they just all disappeared and I didn't have to deal with them anymore. Going on Kadara and dealing with those bandit outposts is bad enough. I don't even deal with them. That's the point. I just don't want them to be there. If there was a mod that could get rid of them, that would be great. I probably would, wouldn't oh, use it because I don't mod a lot. But I did mod some Dragon Age Origins a while back, and that was cool. I need to do a little more, but... I think once I finish the main story and stuff, I'm probably gonna just livestream a bunch of Andromeda. And just, like, get all the, like, little side questy things and all that. Um... What are we doing? We're looking at Ket, so I'll bring Jal. Oh, I wanted to bring Jal. And Drek. I really do love that ship. Uh, like, I think the design is fairly... It's, 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 it's got enough substantial difference from the Normandy that you don't mix them up. Like, I'm looking at my models right now. And you don't see how you could really mix them up. And it's got like foil red on the sides. It's so nice. <laughs> Just drops the nomad out. Let's see. Where we are supposed to be going. Way out into the middle of nowhere. Excellent. Hmm. It's gonna be... Up. Up high. Oh, fiddly. Hmm. Not sure how to safely get up there. to reliably get up there, but we can try this one. We'll try. And try and try and try again. The Nomad is ready to deploy. Let's change the color.
Midas. Nebula. Let's do Tachanka Grit. Yeah, my bright red race car. I hear the uh, the physical model of this, which was like two hundred dollars back in the day of the Nomad, is like fifty bucks right now, and it's like super cool. Like I was thinking about getting it if I had like a little bit of extra spare cash, I'd probably get it. But I don't need that. It's, it's winter time. I have no Smoke extra cash. In the distance. Probably the crash ship we're looking for. Hey, there's a road. But 50, I don't know, I'm tempted. 50 bucks, and it's really cool. Cat killing other cat? Come on, kid, let's get in there. Cat killing other cat? Um. Oops. Um. Let's try to do the sniper rifle, I guess. Really? Is it out? Are, are you really out of range? Want to switch between those two? What in tarnation? Wait, there's still more enemies. No time for scanning. Ah! Oh, okay, never mind. Find something else. <laughs> oh no, that's why! Oh my gosh, you scared the crap out of me. That's okay. Oh my gosh, okay. Oh god, one of them was invisible and glitching out, and oh my gosh. Okay, okay, okay. What's this? It appears to be a cat data log, Pathfinder. It may contain saved data of some variety. Can we access this data, Sam? The device is locked. When has a simple lock ever stopped you, Sam? Come on, hack this thing. Pathfinder, it is not just a simple lock. We have never <laughs> encountered a cat device with security like this before. I suggest we bring it back to the Tempest for further analysis. No, don't bring it back to the Tempest. Bad I'm idea. Could help with it. No, no. Really? Okay. Suvi, interesting. Not Gil or something. Or Dra or not Drac, uh, what's his name? Oh, there was, but this is, I mean, this is dissension in the ranks, right? Maybe there are, like, loyalists to the Archon, and then there are some who are like, hey, uh, what's going on? This is not what we're supposed to be doing, and can we move on, please? <laughs> Like with our actual mission. Pretty, pretty, please, with the cherry on top. I love Ellie. I love all these planets. They look so cool. All of them look really cool. Suvi! Welcome back. Thank you. Guess what? I have a project for you. It's almost unbelievable that some of the cat would be fighting their own. The cat always seems so monolithic, almost faceless. There's so much we still don't know about how their society functions. The stuff you've brought in is helping shed some light on those questions. Good. Speaking of which, this device you found at that destroyed cat ship, 
It's secured with a biometric lock that can only be activated with a specific genetic code. Right. So, like a fingerprint scan, except with a genetic fingerprint. Exactly. Whatever's in this, it's probably only meant for trusted individuals. So you're saying I have to track down some ket? But that would be impossible, Ryder. Remember those ket genetic samples you scanned on Vault? Lexi's been working on the data, and I have an idea that just might work. We should go talk with her when you have time. Okay, let's go! Let's do it! Let's go, let's go, let's go! This is exciting. You have AVP outstanding, Pathfinder. Right, mm-hmm. Oh, no. There's my dog being all cute and adorable, like he does. Got your memo, Suvi. Data's right here, but I'm not sure what you're expecting to find. Tell me you have all sequenced. Yes, of course. It was the first thing I... Perfect. Sam, can you test combinations of sequences against the lock? Testing. Brute force, Dr. Anwar? Tried and true methods. <laughs> and with Sam's processing speed, it should take no time. Key found. No! Well, we thought it was a data log, but, it, but it's not. It's... It's... Uh... It just locked onto a transmission. Uh... Does it compromise our security? The device is a receiver. It will not reveal our location. This transmission is... audio. The Archon has abandoned our way. Oh. Defies protocol. He abuses his authority, obsesses over remnant secrets, and keeps us cut off from home. This cannot continue. He will return to the path of right or be destroyed. This is my promise. An Archon stands tall only while we hold him up. Hmm. Someone's really upset at the Archon. A collectivist culture would take a harsh view of any action that defied the will of the group. And isolating the Ket here would breed resentment. They may feel abandoned. Ket feeling abandoned? <laughs> Some things are universal. I, I wonder if there's a way to trace the signal. Scanning for it's like point, a... I'll transmit it to your Omni tool, in case you want to check it out. Underground what propaganda. We'll out there? I don't know. It might be a base of Ket dissidents organizing against the Archon. Whatever it is, please be careful, Ryder. Always, always. I'm always careful. I'm always careful. I knew it was the Primus. I knew it was like the second in command. Let's see. Does Sam have anything to say? Hello, Ryder. Thanks, Sam. Nothing more. Where's all the rest of my collectibles? I don't have many collectibles. I'm sad. Garden. Thanks again for coming with me. You want to know the plants we seeded are Tira Azhana, handful of water from Rannoch. <gasps> Common Irsal, a Thessian bloom that smells like honey. Li Lace and lilac, a flower they found on Eden Prime, and a few others. Oh my gosh. Oh. From Lexi. Ryder, after our last discussion, Sam and I thought it best if we both took a crash course in AI history to get a better understanding of each other's perspectives. Interesting. <laughs> Those two, like, converse on their own. It's been immensely helpful in finding common ground, but also for highlighting the differences between Sam and the Geth. The Geth didn't need the Quarians to survive, but Sam cannot carry out his primary functions without a Pathfinder. I still don't like that Sam has the ability to stop your heart, but I no longer have nightmares about him getting trigger happy with your life. Okay, okay, that's good. Ryder, thank you for visiting my family with me. For someone with such a small family, it must have been overwhelming, but you didn't show it at all. Oh, thanks. I want to go see how my brother's doing. Eos. The signal's on Eos? Of course it is. There's a massive cat facility out there in the wasteland. We were just on EOS. Oh. Mm, cluster map. EOS. Home of Eos and Prodromos. 
Maybe we should use the names that, you know, they already had for the place. Like, at least system names, you know? Talk to the Angara and be like, Oh, hey, this is, uh, this is what you call the place? Cool. At least we use uh, Varl's actual name and everything, you know? I mean, we didn't really name any of them. Because they were just, like, numbers. Uh, it should be Drak and Jaw. Should be fine. Should be a okay. The scent is green. Actually, it's brown. But thank you. Coordinating. Path is calm. I remember hearing them say once that we were going to be able to customize the Tempest a little bit, but I guess that was one of those things that got kind of thrown out at the last minute. Come on. Locate the source. What? It's right there? Like, right outside our... Oh no, was this... Oh, this was Padromos. Yeah, it's right outside our main facility. I thought it would be, like, in the wasteland. Oh. It is gonna be in the wasteland. Okay. We just have to go off this plateau, and then we're kind of in that area where the cat likes to chill. Maybe? Or they're... Yeah. Right here? Or am I looking at this weird? No, oh, yeah, it should be here. Like, in using this facility or what? I think it says it's below me. Can I use this to go underground? No, doesn't. Like it. <sighs> oh, and is there a cave right under here? Okay, let's see. There might be. The cliff gets really sheer right here. I think. Of course, it could just. Here we go! Yep, now we're on level with it. Oh. Aha! <laughs> I'm a genius! <laughs> the headlights don't do much, but that's funny. Whoa. Loot from our outposts. And an Ark escape pod. Where'd they get that? They're not keeping it. We need an up-close scan. Oh, I thought it was like looking at this, but... It was just once we got in. Hang on. Everybody hop back in. I'm not walking if I don't have to. this well let me pick it up but it's cadmium mm -hmm. oh I'm 
There's no cat in here. This wasn't the same one we went into. We found a place similar to this, right? Like, I know we did. This is the nav point yeah. Suvi gave us, but there's nothing here. Just this beacon. They're being careful. Speaking out against the Archon will have consequences. The true location of the transmission will be hidden. another node on this network updating your omni tool with the information uh, okay like how far are we talking here oh wow far away thank you for letting me travel even while I'm technically underground some games don't do that. Some games are cruel. It's up. Yeah. yeah. We purpose build world by world. That's the way to keep things going. I like it. It's a good plan. It's a good plan. I am Pathfinder. Ra 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 ra. I am. <laughs> oh my god! That was hilarious. I am Pathfinder. Ra ra ra. Oh my god. Oh, that was hilarious. Okay, this is not where I want to be, but cool beans. <laughs> okay, maybe I should actually go around the other this way. something. Is it what I have to scan? Is it what? Okay, well, I maybe don't want to do that yet. Pathfinder, I have located another node on this network, updating your Omni tool with the information. Okay. I was like, what's that glowy bit? Oh my gosh! 
I forgot about those things. Sam, another memory prompt? Yes, though my memory array remains locked. Additional triggers are required. Let's see. Um... See if there's any more. I don't think there's any more here. That was the last one for Eos. Excellent. Oh no, it's out in wild space where I haven't been. Oh well, no, I haven't seen that one. No, wait, I have. No, I haven't. Dang it. Or that. Dang, this place is huge. It's huge. And we'll just head straight south. I need to pick up another. We might pick up another outpost. I don't know if we can see the outposts in the blank space or not. Or not outpost. Uh, forward station. Up, we're up to you, sir. His name is the Archon, and he's a really big jerk. There we go. I was like, we're going, I think we got an upgrade or something that lets us, uh, lets the base speed be a bit faster in the six wheel mode. But going over a hundred miles an hour is much better. Much better. That's cat tech. Stay alert. Mm-hmm. Ah. Ow. It's fine. I did that on purpose. It's cool. Are you guys impressed with my driving skills? Aren't you? Looks like that's it for hostiles. Let's see what this beacon has for us. You guys have any reload state? Yes, thank you. You need to do that to deactivate the shield. Pathfinder, I have located another node on this network. Oh. Updating your Omni tool with the information. Let's see, it's probably going further. Wait, what? What is that? Oh, good. It's closer to one of my outposts. Oh, just running back and forth. Cross ears. It's fine. Usually three is the, you know, prerequisite number for doing things. I don't know if you're aware. Bioware. Mm -hmm. Got to turn around go the other way and follow the road. Shoo! Road. Wasn't that the one I took out a while back? Like for a different thing? Yo, I'm here! Well, 
like this. It stands tall. The transmission is strong and unobstructed what? here, Pathfinder. Looks like we found it then. Good for dropping crap? What do, you, what do you mean? Why did you decide to speak when there were enemies? Here they come! Please hit me. Do it. Come on, you can do it. Okay. Just going through and wrecking everybody's day. Just charging them. It's fun. And I like if when I remember to jump up in the air and then use my ground pound ability. It does a pretty cool effect. Exaltation lifted our ancestors out of sorrow and tribulation. This noble gift now allows us to raise others and share in the genetic bounty of this galaxy. But the Archon would selfishly hoard what Helios has to offer. Recorded messages? This sermon meant to inspire the Ket? Well, we found it. This looks like a comm console. It's probably what's sending out the messages. All that work, and this is all we get? And so you have found me. Same, bro. You are a single-minded creature, Pathfinder. I see it now. Your determination will grant the Ket dominion over this galaxy. Determination is a personality trait, not a genetic one. Not that personality is something you understand, or have. You waste time on pettiness. I did not reveal myself as a traitor easily. I did so only because I seek a mutual benefit. No. Getting rid of the Archon. The Archon's obsession with the Remnant incites chaos and endangers all we've worked for. This must end. Still not seeing how I don't benefit from chaos within Ket ranks. Because it means the Archon lives and challenges you for Meridian, which you desire. I need only ensure nothing stands between you and your target. Once he is cut down, the remnant will cease to be a concern. We will complete our purpose here and leave. Exhorting the Ankara. One day you will be family. Till then, fight if you must. But I offer a reprieve from this conflict, so you can destroy no. a mutual enemy. No. The Ket cannot be trusted. No. Ryder, think. Why do you oppose the Archon? The Archon says he will use Meridian to dominate this cluster. He says Meridian will bring us victory. We have never needed Remnant to be victorious. No, he wants more. His ambition is plain. I am not alone in this thought. What exactly do I get from this deal? Sometime soon, I will be called upon by the Archon to destroy you. When that time arrives, I will provide you with the means to disable my ship. Or you could just leave me alone. And should Meh. you fail to bring down the Archon, my treachery will be exposed. You make me sick. We don't deal with Ket. Ever. So be it. I hope you found some satisfaction chasing my messages. I you didn't. Will nothing else from this. I bid you goodbye, Pathfinder. We will not speak again. Bye. I'm not working with you. You still want to... You still want to... Exalt people. The Archon does not serve Kent's interests, only his own. 
He wastes our time on the remnant, but keeps all knowledge for himself. These are the acts of a traitor, not true Kent. The Archon believes Meridian will bring him power. He will become the master of the remnant, its sole master. Once Helios submits, where does the traitor turn his gaze? Think. Understand. Our home is in peril. Mm-hmm. I don't... Yeah, no, dissension in the ranks is good for me. So, that's... That done. Agent of Change. I exposed a rift between the Primus and the Archon, suggesting that Cat are not as uniform in their beliefs as they might appear. Interesting. It's curious. Curious! Mm. Man. Uh, I don't know if I should do that first. Eh, I don't know. But I think, to be freaking honest, I think I'll go to Meridian next. Nothing else I can always go back, I guess, and be like, no, wait, let me do it this way. But if they're going to give you the option to do it in any way you choose. What? Well, actually, really quick, before I call it, I'm actually going to run, see if anything's changed with my brother. I kind of doubt it, but I'd like to verify and, you know, make sure. Let's just go. Because they didn't put him on the quest log before. All clear. But I kind of figure they would now. They put most things on the quest log. Welcome back. Thank you. Mm, Nexus. I guess we have to go to the Nexus anyway. Hopefully, it doesn't start anything. I don't want to start any trouble yet. Start my trouble later. Okay, I was like, can I skip that one? Please. It looks very similar to the Citadel. Just right here. It makes sense though to, you know, the Citadel was an efficient, large, like huge design, you know? A big mobile home, basically. Makes sense to pattern it after that. All right, let's see if my dog will ever shut up. Oh yes, uh, right, um, no? Later. I never went to that, did that AI thing, too. Whoopsie daisy. Cryo bay. I mean, seriously, man, how long is it gonna take you to wake up? He's gotta wake up at some point. I can't just leave him on ice the whole game. Maybe at the very end he'll wake up. This is not good. Back for a visit? That's all, Shh. Harry. Thanks. I'll be here if you need me. You're being lazy. Wake up. It's time to get up. It's time to get up. Look at my new outfit. <laughs> But yeah, thank you guys for joining me. I appreciate it. Um, I will maybe be able to upload this and maybe you guys can be like, no, do something else before you do the Meridian thing. But I would like, I think I'll probably do the Meridian one next, which is kind of freaky to think about to be able to do that. But 
Um, it'll be cool. I'm excited. I wonder, is the game, is that like the end story? I don't know. I can't, I feel like, I feel like it might not be. I feel like there might be something else, but this is cool stuff. So thank you guys for joining me. I appreciate it. And I will see you in the next one.